Okay. To prepare for my SLC, I also reflected on my habits of work and learning. Also, because we do student led conferences, it builds motivation and critical thinking in our students. The SLCs connect families deeply to the growth of their child and the work of the school. I would also like to share work where I struggled to meet the learning target and could improve. So a quick reminder that our SLC student-led conferences are taking place about two weeks from now. So student-led conferences happen twice a year. The main difference between SLCs and the parent-teacher conferences is students are at the center of the conversation. It pushes them to think deeply about their own learning and their progress and share that with their families. I'm usually scared of telling my parents things about how school is going and like what I'm not doing good in. And the SLC helped me have the courage to tell my parents what I can improve on. Two to three weeks before the SLCs, we spend every day of our crew lessons preparing students identify a piece of work that they are proud of, a piece they have struggled with, their habits of work and learning, and a goal that they have created for themselves. What they are sharing and articulating has to have evidence and data. Students really have to be extremely honest and reflective about their learning and their growth. My goal is to uh, get over my shyness and uh, ask more questions or ask for help. At the end of the preparation process, students practice their presentation with each other. I'm excited about sharing my projects, like my math work. They give really great feedback. She added a link of her work and she spoke truthfully. Yes, yes. Normally we do student-led conferences in person, but this year we use Zoom. Whenever you're ready. Today I'll be reflecting on some of my past work. I'll be talking to you about my proud piece, my challenge piece, and some of my goals and I've met them or not. I actually so didn't feel nervous because I know what I'm saying. Guys. I felt very prepared. I was much more engaged with my mom. So now I would like to talk about my proud piece. I chose my math integer project. So the learning target that I mastered is I can create a fun video or graphic that explains a math skill or concept. The SLCs this year, students were really honest about the struggles they had during remote learning. I created an improvement plan by creating a whoop goal for myself. I wish to, to push myself more as a learner, like asking more questions. And My mom and my dad asked questions and I was like, able to give them more detail. It felt good. So in student-led conferences, students name and describe the growth they have seen in themselves. It's an experience that honors the student's journey as a learner and it also honors the families as important partners in students' learning and progress. Thank you for attending my SLC and for listening to my presentation. Do you have any questions for me about my work? Very nice. I'm proud of you also. <laughs> <laughs>